Hi, I'm Aaron Chalmers, and you're watching Sport and Icons. Now, one of the reasons why Deontay Wilder has carried on boxing ever since he lost to Tyson Fury the third time is because he wants a fourth fight with Tyson Fury. One of the reasons why he's turned down the WBC Bridgeweight world title opportunity against Alan Babich is because he wants to continue at heavyweight because he wants that fourth fight with Tyson Fury. So I suppose the question is, could Wilder ever beat Tyson Fury? They've fought three times and he hasn't done it once. Now granted, in the first fight, that was a Tyson Fury that's a shadow of what he is now. And he did drop Tyson Fury twice in that fight, round nine, I think it was, and then round number 12, heavy. In the third fight, Fury got a little bit uh, sloppy, shall we say, a little bit overconfident, and walked pretty much straight on to the right hand. Hit him straight in the forehead, that uh, wobbled him, of course, then of course Wilder took him down. And of course, um, Fury still wasn't properly recovered and Wilder took him down again. So again, he dropped him twice in the third fight. But could Wilder ever beat Tyson Fury? If he's hit Tyson Fury and dropped him four times and Fury keeps getting up, could Wilder ever beat him? Now, one thing to point out would be pretty obvious, just because Fury's got up four times doesn't mean he'll always get up for sure okay everybody's got that button maybe Wilder just didn't hit him in the right place it could be that maybe Wilder's power is overrated if you look at who he's knocked out well who were they maybe Fury just cannot be knocked out who knows he can be put down of course but he can't be knocked out we've seen Tyson Fury hit the floor on quite a few occasions so maybe Fury just keeps on getting up. Maybe he can't be knocked out. That's unlikely. As I said, everybody has a button. But he can't ever outbox Tyson Fury. And for me, if he can't beat Tyson Fury at a time when Fury, Fury was inactive, he was coming back after two and a half years, living in kebab shops and putting gear up his nose and all that kind of stuff, for two journeymen, if you like, and Wilder couldn't beat him then. As I said back then, you, you couldn't beat him then, so you're not going to beat him in a rematch, which is why I predicted Fury would actually stop him. And I did actually predict round number seven. Okay, a bit of a lucky guess, I suppose. And in, and, in, and in the third fight, again, I said that Fury will stop him. But what chances has Wilder got? If he can hit Fury with his best shot, and Fury keeps getting up, and if he can't outbox him, why go for the fourth fight? Why bother? Maybe Wilder feels that Fury can be put down and kept down. Maybe. Maybe he, he knows he didn't catch Fury on the button, as it were. Maybe it's the payday. I mean, for me, if I was going to fight somebody three times and I'd come up short all three times and the first fight, yes, Fury should have got the decision in that one. Why bother for a fourth time? Why bother? I mean, how many times are you going to fight somebody before you may get one win? Now, he could fight Fury 10 times and he might just get a win. He might. But it's looking very unlikely, isn't it? So all the time that Tyson Fury is WBC champion, if I was Deontay Wilder, I'd stay away from him. For real, I would stay away from him. What's the point? What's the point of going in there and getting beat again? There's literally no point to it whatsoever. If I was Wilder, I'd be looking at other big money fights like a Joshua, like a Dillian White, like a Joe Joyce, of course, Andy Ruiz Jr. I'd be looking at those kind of ones because maybe he can get a win. Maybe, or maybe not. Maybe the best of Wilder was gone. Maybe Wilder was never going to be that good because he, again, let's be honest, he has been protected as champion and certainly protected all the way up to being champion awful awful resume awful resume but ultimately he wants to carry on he wants that fourth fight with Tyson Fury I mean do you all want to see that fourth fight I'm not sure I do honestly I'm not sure I do but 
Anyway, that's my thoughts on it all. You drop me yours, click thumbs up, subscribe. Catch you next video.